The Bad Batch, Season 3, Episode 7, Thoughts. This episode is called Extraction, another episode I love. Spoilers for everything Star Wars leading up to and including this episode. Let's dive right in. So, yeah, we open on after the fighting... And yeah, the operative from from right away is just not going along with what the the squad is is saying. And yeah, um, very effective as this sort of yeah, he's a, he he poses a very serious threat. And I really appreciate that he survives the episode. It is going to be so cool seeing him. Yeah, you know, I imagine he's. We're gonna see more of him trying to to catch up to them. It is also possible we're just gonna see the what's done to him in response. To you know, since he did fail multiple times now. Stop! Hammer time. And, yeah, very cool fighting down in the, the the guts of the building, you know. The crosshair pulls some sick moves, as usual. And, and yeah, the operative manages to shoot down the, the vehicle and gets chewed out because, you know, they're supposed to bring back Omega alive get those shuttles in the air like they just don't care and I like the thing you're just as bad as Hunter I'm worse because he won't just let her you know she she feels confident that she's got it all under control and he keeps like Every single little thing, you know, are you sure you can carry all that? Is your bow ready? All this stuff, just, you know. <laughs> I wonder which Omega hates more when Crosshair is just, like, apathetic and nihilistic and, like, I belong in the cell. Or when he's, like, you know, the, after they've bonded and he's, like, you know, micromanaging every single little thing. Love the guerrilla com uh, combat tactics that the the bad batch pull to to fight the, you know superior numbers of well trained well armed military and very very intense duel between crosshair and the operative and very dark when like the operative grabs him and holds him under water. This show is rated TV PG. This is like holy crap. I mean, Star Wars has always been dark. I, uh, I don't know. Maybe this episode is rated like I forget. Do they have a TV PG thirteen? Some or is it TV fourteen? Something along those lines. Because I feel like this is, yeah. And, yeah, um, ultimately Rex manages to talk Wolf out of it, but Wolf is also not quite ready to outright go against the Empire. And, yeah, you know, really appreciate this thing. You know, that's something we've been seeing this entire show, the entire Bad Batch show. This thing of, you know, some clones refuse to you know, be good soldiers and follow orders. Some, yeah, we are all individuals. And, yeah, I, I quite appreciate this thing of, like, Wolf is not willing to, to join them, but he is willing to let them go. And what was it he said, you know, bury their... Uh, they're they're dead or so, something along those lines. And let's see, I think that might be what I have for for this one. But yeah, continue to really love this show, love this season. Um, yeah, I I am really really excited to see how 
they're going to end this show. You know, just... Yeah. Um, supposedly this is the last season, and it will be 15 episodes total. And... Yeah. Um, really... Yeah, I, I can hardly wait to see how they're going to, to close it off. Really loving this tendency that some recent shows have had where they're like, no, this is this is how many seasons we're going to do. We're going to tell a complete story, and then we're going to end it. You know, I there's so many American TV shows where they just keep going and going forever, as long as they at all can milk it. Like... I eventually stopped watching Scrubs, for example, and NCIS, stuff like that. Just They kept pushing it. So really appreciate Because I, I do believe, this this was episode 7, so there's what, 9 episodes left? Something like that. You know, I do believe, yeah, we're almost halfway through the season. I do believe that they can deliver a satisfying conclusion given the time that's left. Like, if this was, like, the second to last episode, I'd be like, there's no way they're going to be able to wrap up everything. But, yeah, as it is, it does feel like they're going to be be able to. And, yeah. Um, the, yeah, so next episode premieres in one week. So, yeah, really excited for that one as well.